Hi everyone, it's Tony. Happy Memorial Day to everyone. Hope you have a great weekend. Yeah, this morning I just wanted to talk about a ministry from Kenya, Africa. It's a ministry to orphans and widows. And it, uh, God brought it to my attention recently. And we've been doing what we can to help them out. Yeah, it's amazing, the need in Kenya. Uh, recently, there's been floods in Kenya, and they've lost all their food and their clothing, their blankets. It's pretty bad. So, you know, we're trying to get the word out that maybe there's people that would like to help this ministry. Um, we know for sure it's a worthy cause. We've checked it out thoroughly, um, done some videos about it, and spoken to the pastor personally. We've got them on film and the children also. Um, yeah, it is um, Shalom Friends Orphanage. And it's located in Kenya, Africa, in a very remote area. So they're having um, needs for food and clean water. Um, the caregiver there, um, pastor in charge, is... Vinny Aniancha Nayamare, and he can be reached on Messenger, Facebook Messenger, at Vinny Aniancha, and um, you'll find him very um, humble and kind person, and very honorable to to care for all of these orphans and try to meet their needs. That is not an easy task. Most of us know even caring for one child is so expensive and so laborious. So I give them a lot of credit for being willing to take that on. And yeah, we want to do all we can as the body of Christ to help him, his wife, and those that labor with them to see that these children get fed properly and they get clean water and a blanket. Um, all of their blankets were flooded and their food was destroyed. So they need help, and a little goes a long way, $10, $20, whatever you could do. We did send a, set up um, a fundraiser. It's here. It's it, This is the fundraiser. It's Give, Send, Go to Shalom Friends. I'll, I'll put it on this side so that it reads properly. I'll, let me put it on this side. That way you can see it properly. It's uh, please donate to give, send, go to Shalom Friends Orphanage. Any amount will help. So yes, it's the give, send, go uh, Shalom Friends Orphanage. So if you go to the website, give, send, go, it's a Christian platform. And you type in Shalom Friends Orphanage. They'll give you ways to donate, and it really, really, really would be helpful to, to reach out to this ministry for these orphans and um, to, to donate a little to their cause. Um, most of us can give a little, you know, $20, $10, something. We, we can give something, most of us. So... Yeah, pray about it and check it out. Uh, maybe contact Pastor Vinny and talk to him about it and um, see what you could possibly do for these little ones that Jesus cares for because I have uh, some scripture verses I'll, I'll read for us. Let's read those now. Now those, um, I will also show you who the people are. Here they are, beautiful group of people, Pastor Vinny and his orphans, widows, his wife, you know, those who help in the ministry. This is their um, dwelling that was flooded out and they lost everything. The children are actually sleeping on the floor, um, kind of on top of one another. They, they had to rent another building. They need funds for that. Um, they need blankets. Um, they need food, so they need donations so they can get these things. Um, anything that we can um, to help them will be really appreciated. 
by uh, all of them in need. But what I would like to do to help people understand if you're not a Christian, uh, why we as Christians, why we, um, why our hearts go out to these causes and why we give because um, Jesus instructed us when we give to these little ones, these orphans and widows, first of all, that's pure religion. It says in James one twenty seven, pure religion. If you read in the Bible, the book James, verse 127, pure religion is to care for the orphans and widows in their distress and to keep oneself from being polluted by the world. Now that's pure religion according to the Bible. And also, we want to know what Jesus said because we're followers of Jesus. This channel represents the followers of Jesus Christ, those who are born again into God's family, or those who would like to be. And we're hoping to show you the way, if you would like to be. So we share messages, and for, for the salvation messages, for that reason. And I have some on the channel, if you'd like to look those up and listen to those. I think you'll be blessed. But for the reason we share and we reach out to the orphans and the widows for God is written in the book of Matthew, chapter 25. I'll read some of those verses now. We're in Matthew 25, chapter chapter 25 of Matthew, and we're going to be reading 34 all the way down to... 45 basically so we're going to read some of the verses now uh what it says in matthew what jesus christ told us to do okay when he, when he was on the earth then shall the king say to them well that that's verse 34 but let us go down here he says for i was hungered and ye gave me meat i was thirsty and ye gave me drink this is jesus speaking I was a stranger, and ye took me in, naked, and ye clothed me. I was sick, and ye visited me. I was in prison, and you came unto me. And then shall the righteous answer him, saying, Lord, when saw we thee hungry, and fed thee, or thirsty, and gave thee a drink? When saw we thee a stranger, and took thee in, or naked, and clothed thee? Or when did we see you sick, or in prison, and come to thee? And the king, Jesus Christ, shall answer, and say unto them, Verily I say unto you, Inasmuch as ye have done it unto one of these least of these, my brethren, calls them his brethren, these, these little ones, Ye have done it unto me. And then shall he say also unto them on the left hand, Depart from me, because ye are cursed. So those on the left hand that kind of could care less about God's work, and they don't, they don't reach out to these causes, they take care of their own needs and their own people, and that's it. You know, they don't see a need to go beyond that to those who just can't help themselves. And are struggling and have nothing and need us. We, we They need us. And uh, those won't be going to the same place as us who are reaching out, trying to do God's work. And uh, we have a heavenly kingdom that we're looking forward to. And we have rewards we're looking forward to. And But even so, we're blessed now by giving. Um, these people have blessed my life greatly. Oh, they're wonderful to know. They're sweet. They're kind. They're humble. Um, they're very spiritual people. And I think you'll be blessed by by reaching out to them. Which you can reach out to Pastor Vinny on Messenger. Uh, to Vinny on Yacha. I will put that information below this video. Um, there's several ways. He has a WhatsApp. Uh, Western Union. MoneyGram. You can send. He has, there's PayPal. Um, they can let you know ways to donate or, you know, real easy, go to Give, Send, Go. As I was just showing everyone, the Give, Send, Go, you could go there. Let's put that back up here for a moment. Um, 
Give, send, go. You could go there to Shalom Friends Orphanage and just donate right there online with the link they'll give you to donate. And it'll go right, uh, this will, every penny, you know, will go to them. So it's there, it's for them. It's funding for their ministry only. Um, not for any organization. This will go directly to Pastor Vinny and his people. Okay, so if you want to uh, give to a, to a wonderful cause, there you have it. And I'll put information below the video. I really pray that um, the body of Christ, who's ever listening, um, steps up. We need you to step up now and give something. Do something. Pray. Share. Um, let the need be known. But please do something. Because um, the needs are many, the workers are few, Jesus said, and those of us who are trying to reach out are doing all we can, but we can't, um, you know, do it all. So we're doing what we can, it's a little, but we really need supporters, we need people around us even to pray and tell us to keep going and you can do this, things like that, so... Yes, yeah, so thank you so much for listening. Uh, my name is Tony. I um, my channel name is Messages for Jesus. Um, you can see that on YouTube, and hopefully you'll be blessed by it. And you'll go on there. You can also see Pastor Vinny and the children, and hear some messages about salvation. So thank you for listening. We're just so grateful uh, for anything you can do. Um, and truthfully, it'll be remembered for forever. Forever it'll be remembered, I'm sure. So, so it has uh, more than just um, the value of a material possession. It has eternal value when we um, serve the kingdom of God and reach out and share with them. Uh, even a, a cup of cold water, uh, Jesus said in Matthew, let's go back to Matthew 10, 42, where Jesus said, even a cup of cold water given to these little ones will um, help, will bring us a reward. So a cup of cold water is not, is really not much to give, is it? So that would be found in Matthew 10, 42, which I'll read it. Whosoever shall give to drink unto one of these little ones a cup of cold water only in the name of a disciple, verily I say unto you, he shall in no wise lose his reward. So you'll want to look at those verses. They really are helpful. And um, they really can help you understand why as Christians we really need to do something to help these folks in these type of ministries so thanks for listening heavenly father be with this ministry help pastor Vinny provide for the little ones and show us ways we can help lord we're so blessed in the usa and we have so much more lord than it's just unbelievable the possessions we have and um just only for ourselves and they need to be shared and we need to reach out we need to stop being so selfish in this country lord and so greedy please lord move the hearts lord bring your body to this cause father god reach out to them lord and help them understand the need is real um, not make excuses why they can't help and just step up to the plate uh, for Vinny and uh, pastor Vinny his laborers, his wife, and these little children, and these widows, Lord. And thank you so much for all you do in our lives, Lord. Please have mercy on our souls, Father God, and please forgive us of our sins. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, amen. Okay, thanks everyone um, for listening, for helping, for sharing anything you can do. If you can't do anything, just pray for them, please. It'll mean so much. Bye now.